Hi friends, today we are going to talk about one thing that has changed in S4HANA. So with S4HANA you want to probably have in when you get to uh, accounts payable report FPL1 and you want to get report based on the profit center. Okay, so in FPL1N you will not have it in the layout. So there is a new there, there's a new transaction that you can use. Let me make the fonts a bigger because so that you can see it bigger so lots of time i get this complaint that the font is too small so i'll make it bigger so this is the way you can change the font go to apply and now this is okay okay now i go to fgi3 this is the transaction and i go here and this one i just imported okay this may not be here so how you can do it i can just show you i can go to click create and here you can choose this one and the moment you say you do this this is already exist and you can just ex hit execute and then it shows so this is the way to bring it there okay so then i'll do what i'm going to do so i'll just cancel this and i'll again go here fgi3 okay initially this will not be there that's the previous way you have to bring it here now you just double click on it like in a, any SAP S4 HANA and here you can see all these things this is the characteristics this is the output type these are the different variables okay and now here you click execute and here you get the stuff now what I'm going to do is I'll probably put uh, 10 10 okay and I'll say all items and here once I execute so it says classic drill down report okay so here you can see the profit centers and all those things so let me go i will not do drill down what i'm going to say i will just execute again and here i will select graphical report output and i'll put this one 10 10 and i'll put all items and i'll execute okay so you can see so here you can see the profit centers you can see this is based on profit centers okay so this is this is very important okay here we don't have a profit center but if you had one it would have been very important this is very important uh, so the transaction code is fgi3 here you can see and the the report that we were using i'll just go back and the report was this so here you can see it's very important. Uh, so that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.